Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor. No. Yeah, so we just put in about 50 some gallons, uh, 64 gallons. Got a demo probably next week, Monday. The guy's picking it up. Uh, it's a 22 hard top sliding windows, large front windows, large wipers. Easy to see out of swing front window. Got the new Phantom Garmin. I'll be setting up. I got the VHF antenna setting up on top. You can put a GPS puck, which I don't see there which Garmin's pretty good about picking up anyway. But if you ever get like, say autopilot or something, you probably want to put up one of them uh, Garmin 19 uh, GPS antennas on it. You got anchor guard, you got the uh, Fulton two speed. That's out of pewter so it doesn't rust on you. You got that extra low speed. Back to the keel roller, the keel roller. You don't want the boat to rest on that. That's just if you submerged it. So your keel isn't going to hit that cross member on the trailer, which again, that's stout as heck anyway. Uh, you got a swing tongue, so make sure if you do swing it, you tuck the trailer wires back in so you don't pitch them. I can see them in there, they're fine. You got a flat five on the trailer wires. You got a two inch ball with a peekaboo hole with a standard flip. Uh, cables versus chains, cables don't rust on you. Tongue jack. Uh, it's this teal. You got net holders over there in gaff hooks. You got tandem axle trailers, disc on all four, dual axles, and they're torsion. You got like five lugs, 80 pound torque. Uh, they're Carlisle tires, they're ST205, 75 or 14s. On that, you got two bunks, two by sixes with slicks. You got Scott 1101s or sixes, electrics. Uh, that's got the extended uh, 30 inch boom on it. That looks like the newer 51 or higher on the Garmin transducer. You got Panomics on the other side, trim tabs. Uh, they're gonna have to probably take this though and move it on top because it's hitting these thumb, thumb screws. You can see that. This is a T99 extra long power trim, 6AVKX105-3253, 11 by 7 on the prop. It's a T99 remote up front, stainless prop shaft, drive shaft. You got internal zincs, twin cylinder, uh, two clear, two uh, primers, main coat on the paint. This is FT, uh, F250, and uh, this one here, same thing, salt water protected, stainless prop shaft, drive shaft, internal zinc, each cylinder, and zinc on the main block, zinc on the outside. There and down below, zinc on the back. 14 and three quarters, I think by 17. Yep, right here is your pitch. That's one of them, uh, you know, pointed, they call them a ballistic prop. Uh, that other holes for your uh, fish box, which there's a valve inside, I'll show you later. And then your main drain, I used mine, didn't have the drain plug in it. You got your ladder, that's your pan optics. We'll put it on that side just for the spray instead of putting it back here. If it does, it will go up under so you won't get the spray inside. Looks like he's got it mounted right. And he adjusted the trailer, good, so that shouldn't hit. And he's got rear deck steering and the control there is for the kicker motor in back. He's got rocket launchers in back there. Uh, so now we will take it to the water and see what happens. This is Boat Doctor out.